Hey my village people, welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new here, my name is Kande, and on today's episode, I am going to be sharing with you all this amazing keto detox drink. Now, I know with the whole quarantine and pandemic going on, you have probably put on the extra, maybe 15, 10 pounds perhaps, or you've gone out of your meal plan and you haven't really been diligent with eating clean. Oh, well, this drink is definitely for you, okay? Now, if you follow me on Instagram, by the way, if you're, if you're not following me on Instagram, like, please just excuse me, tell me, what, what are you doing with your life? So go out and follow me on Instagram. It's at Keto Africana. You know, if you follow me, that I talk a lot about this drink because I love it so much. In this video, I will be sharing with you all the specific measurements that you will need for each of the ingredients which we'll be using today. Now, if you guys know me, you know I don't measure anything, okay? But today, for you people, for my special village people, I have some measuring spoons. That I so without further ado, let's get started. Started. Here are the ingredients which you'll be needing for this drink. Let me walk you through them. So first you'll need turmeric powder, ginger powder, cayenne pepper, cinnamon powder, and the star, some apple cider vinegar. And to dilute, we'll be just needing a glass of water, just any type of water, right? I hope you guys are following along. Now, I just put these ingredients in these spoons. This isn't the quantity that you'll be needing. However, I'll show you the quantity that you'll be needing. Now, for the measurement, this right here, you see this is one fourth of a teaspoon. For this amount of water, just a tall glass of water, honestly, it's just a tiny pinch, but let me show you guys. So in our cup i have the one fourth of a teaspoon of cayenne pepper now the cayenne pepper honestly is one of the most important ingredient here and you cannot substitute this for paprika some people have asked me like oh can i substitute this no you cannot sorry just you just need cayenne pepper and then i'm gonna put this in the glass right here the glass is empty This is ginger powder. That's why you kind of see the little um, fibers. Yep. Right there. I hope you just pardon the mess, but I hope you're still seeing everything that I'm putting right there. Turmeric in there it goes. The, the taste of this drink is, is a hit or miss. Some people like it if you like things that are tart. If you like things that are sour, everyone's different. So we put the cinnamon powder right there. So in everything goes. Okay, now for the apple cider vinegar, I am using two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar. It doesn't have to be the Bragg's brand, but you want to make sure the apple cider vinegar you get is with the mother because this is the unfiltered raw kind. So, in it goes. And then we put two tablespoons of this. All right, now we put everything in there. Just going to mix everything. You are just going to mix everything. Now... Does it look nasty? Yes. Does it smell nasty? Yes. Will your stomach thank you? Yes, absolutely. So, I am now gonna put this in here to dilute it. In the water it goes. I hope you guys can see everything. Now, don't do this with cold water because if you do it with cold water, all of the um, ingredients just wouldn't dilute properly. You want to make sure everything goes in the water. Let me. All right, you guys. So, this is what your drink is supposed to be looking like. Again, just make sure you mix it. You can even like pop this in the microwave. 
for like maybe 30 seconds to make sure everything dilutes, all of the ingredients dilutes properly. Um, but this is fine for me. Now, so I have this fancy glass because, you know, this drink, like I said, it's not the most pleasant. But if you put it in a fancy glass, maybe that'll help you, like, you know, just chuck it down a, a little bit better. Now, here's the quantity that I'm making. You want to make sure you drink this. That's the turmeric in my hand. But you, you want to make sure you drink this at least maybe twice a day. So, like, in the morning and at night, make sure you um, take this at least twice. Or, or if you want, you can just take it once. So now I'm just going to pour it in this nice fancy glass right here. Because it just it just looks better, you know? It just looks better. So, yeah. So, as you can see, it was super simple, right? It wasn't difficult. Like, these are probably ingredients you likely already have on hand at home. And um, like I said earlier, just make sure that all of the ingredients is nicely stirred and dissolved in the drink. You might have to, like, warm it up in the microwave for a few seconds. But, you know, nothing too major so let's go ahead and taste it are you guys ready honestly i don't expect it to be that bad it looks like orange juice that's why i put it in like you know this fancy glass or whatever because why not get fancy while we detoxify right so lego <laughs> mm. honestly you guys this drink is really not bad like, I know I give, like, on Instagram, I give it a, a hard time as far as the taste, but it's really not bad. Apple cider vinegar on its own tastes worse than this drink. This drink is really not bad, to be honest with you. Like, it, you do get that, like, spicy sensation down your throat from the cayenne pepper, but it's really not bad. You don't want to skimp out on that cayenne pepper, though, because that's what gives it the laxative effect. You know, that's what makes, you know, you poop and stuff like that. So don't skimp out on it and make sure you just follow the measurement that I've provided in this video. Also on Instagram, I got people asking how many times should you be drinking this? I drink it twice a day, once in the morning and once at night. Um, I also got questions asking if this breaks your fast. Now with the quantity or the measurement of each of the ingredients that I provided for this cup, it shouldn't break your fast. You shouldn't worry about this breaking your fast. Now, I don't know if you guys go overboard, perhaps it can, but with this small quantity, you should be fine. Someone also asked me if this drink will make you lose weight. <sighs> you guys, I can't lie to you. Nothing is gonna make you lose weight unless you improve your diet, unless you incorporate physical activity, and unless you fast. This drink is not the savior. So it, it'll be quite deceptive of me to say that this will help you lose weight. Now, this will aid your digestion. This will, you know, help reduce bloating, all of which will, you know, contribute to, you know, weight loss if you're being diligent with the other things that I've mentioned. But don't expect to eat junk food or to eat like crap only to drink this and to like magically slim down. It's not going to happen. This ain't one of those fake slim teas that you see on Instagram or all over social media. So if I, um, if you guys have any questions that I did not answer in this video, let me know in the comment section. And if you watch this video till this point, just know you are the real MVP. You are my village person, okay? So if you did, uh, kindly leave me a martini emoji in the comment section so I know you're a real one. Or just, just leave me like a cup emoji or something. Um, kind of like this glass, this fancy glass right here. So yeah, that's it you guys. I hope I answered all of your questions. Um, just be prepared to use the restroom as soon as you use this, as soon as you drink this and be prepared to, you know, feel nice and light and, you know, just nice and just airy after you have this. So, yeah. Let me see if I can get a thumbnail for this. Mm. This drink is definitely for you if you feel bloated, groggy, and, and you just need that reboot, that cleanse, that detoxification. 
This drink is definitely for you. you guys. This drink is really not bad. On a scale of one to 10, I would probably give it like about a seven. Um, 10 being like really good, one being really bad. Um, so it's about a seven. It's really not bad. Don't be deceived by the ingredients. It's really drinkable. Like I prefer this drink over apple cider vinegar on its own anytime, any day. Like this is the amplified apple cider vinegar. So get with the program. And by the way, guys, do you like my haircut? If you follow me on Instagram, you already seen it. And I dyed it like bluish purplish. I hope you guys like it. All right. Bye, guys. Mwah. Cheers.